thank you for joining us for this segment of Live Healthy. I'm your host, Lauren Collar. This morning, we're talking about lumps and bumps, especially with your kids. When is it time to get those checked out? Joining us today is pediatric general surgeon, Dr. Sam Suter, here to explain when it's time to take those lumps and bumps to a physician to be looked at closer. Thank you for joining us today. Starting with kids, you kind of keep an eye on them, but when are there some things you need to really take to a professional? Sure. Well, lots of folks, lots of parents will bring their children to us concerned about moles or nevi, as we call them, on the skin surface and or lumps and bumps underneath the skin surface, lymph nodes being the most common thing they're looking at. So we will see a fair number of brand new babies who have what looks like a very benign looking birthmark on their scalp. It's often sort of tea colored or coffee colored. Those look benign and they're often ignored even by, even by pediatricians and family practitioners, but many of those are, are going to fall into a category of what's called a nevus sebaceous, and, and those need to be removed. They actually need to, need to be removed so they don't turn into a cancer at some future date, typically 20 years from now, but much better to get them off as an infant so that there's no concern later on. Other nevi, particularly in older children who've been sun exposed, will have the possibility of being malignant and some of those will need to be excised just to be certain that they haven't turned into cancer or into a precancerous lesion. And then we see a fair number of kids, as I, as I mentioned, with lymph nodes, swollen lymph nodes. Now the vast majority of those will be benign, not cancerous, just a, a lymph node doing its job, as we say, typically inflamed because of a virus or nearby skin irritation, even things like acne can cause them to be inflamed. But a few of them, of course, may be a sign of something worse. So if you see the swollen lymph nodes, you feel them, they're not sick at the time, is that a good time to bring them in? I think that's a good idea. It's probably a good idea to go see your pediatrician or family practitioner. They'll help us to figure out whether that's something that needs to be evaluated by a surgeon. Many, many, many patients that we see with lymph nodes, the vast majority, in fact, will never need to have a biopsy. But it's better to check it out ahead of time. So some tips for parents when in doubt, get it checked out? I think that's a good way of putting it. All right. Exactly. Thank you, Dr. Cedar, for joining us. And thank you. Thank you for being here for this segment of Live Healthy. Live Healthy is sponsored by Trident and Somerville Medical Centers and provided as a service to you and your family.